morning everybody. I'm really really excited this morning because I'm in my kitchen and today I'm sharing it with this beautiful granddaughter of mine Isabella and she's going to help me make the noodles and uh, we're going to have a lot of fun together because we love playing in our kitchen and we just like to show you how we can make them. Uh, we've been out in the garden and we found some beautiful fresh zucchini and zucchini is uh, a lovely vegetable. I remember as a child thinking it was just terrible because my mum used to pick the zucchini and she'd she'd boil it and boil it and boil it till it was just like a moment within death <laughs> by the time it was served on a plate and it was just terrible. It was just this mush and had no flavour and no taste and what I've discovered with raw food is that zucchini is marvellous because it is a very bland vegetable and whatever we add to it, it tends to take on those beautiful flavours. So we can have, um, today we're going to use some, all these gorgeous herbs that we've, we've picked in the garden and we're going to bring those into a pesto and, and it'll be absolutely delicious. So Isabella here is, is creating some wonderful noodles and we, we started earlier this morning and we've made some wonderful noodles and these are, are really fun because it gets us away from the starchy, floury noodles that we're all so familiar with and these are fresh and gorgeous and we can add whatever sauce we like to make them truly delicious. So uh, away we go and perhaps I can help Isabella here a little bit. Do you wind it darling and we, would you like to wind it for me and then we'll see if we can make a few more. That's the way and away it goes, doesn't it? <laughs> Is that fun? Yeah. So Isabella's often in the kitchen with me and uh, we have so much fun together creating wonderful, wonderful recipes and when the children come down to uh, spend some time we, we often spend an hour or so in the kitchen. So these are just the, the sort of noodles that we end up with and we also have this lovely fresh piece that's left over in the middle and I often just put those in the juice but they can equally go out into the, um, the worm compost or whatever we want to do with them. So here we are with our beautiful noodles and uh, feel free to add whatever uh, sauce or pesto, you can put veggies through it, you can um, put tomato and it's just absolutely gorgeous. You can almost smell it from here and it's just all fresh and divine. So. We'll uh, look forward to making the next segment, which will be the herb pesto. Hello everybody, here we are in the kitchen and uh, I'm really excited again today to be uh, making a beautiful herb pesto. And my assistant here and my wonderful granddaughter is going to assist me in doing this. And she's going to help put some of these lovely things into the blender for me, aren't you Isabella? Mm -hmm. And uh, she said she'd like to help, so we've got these gorgeous herbs that we picked this morning and uh, which ones do you like Isabella? Yeah. Which, what do you think they are? Parsley. That's parsley yes and what about some of these? Do you know what some of these others are? Mm, mint. Yes so there's mint and what about this one? Mm, Is that thyme? Thyme. Thyme yes and we've got some rosemary here mm. and what about these? Do you know what these are? Garlic. That's garlic, yes. And what happens when we open up the garlic? What do we find inside? A tiny seed. You find little seeds. Look, mm. here they are here, look. Yes, we find like seeds. those, don't we? And then we mince them up, don't we, and put them in our beautiful cooking. Mm -hmm. So which ones do you think you'd like to smell? Because they all smell so that delicious. One. We like the smell of the parsley, do you? Mm -hmm. Yes, so in this particular one we're going to be using some parsley and some mint so, and some thyme. So we're going to put this all into the blender and we're going to make this. Yes, so you'll be able to help me. So do you want to tip those in for me? Or we could just tip the bowl in, that's the way. We've got a cup of parsley and we're going to put half a cup of mint, which we've cut up. So Isabella's going to pop that in for me. We could just tip the whole lot in again. That's the way. Beautiful, beautiful. Can you smell the mint? Yes, do you want to empty it out? And we could, we could, if I do that for you, and you could hold it. That's wonderful. So we've got the mint going in. What else do we need to put in, do you think? Mm. We're going to put some thyme. So we've got some thyme sitting in this little one. Yes, that's the way. So we've got a tablespoon of thyme, and now we're going to put some lemon juice, and we've got a quarter of a cup of lemon juice. Mm. Yes, yeah. so we're going to pop that in there too. Right, that's the way. 
And what else have we got? We've got some lemon zest. Do you know what lemon zest is? No. It's the skin, isn't it? When we when we um, do the zest, we 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 grate a little bit of the lemon and we get this beautiful zest. Did you smell it as it went in? And what else have we got? We've got some cloves that we're going to some some sorry. We've got some garlic we're going to put in. So you might need to use that little spoon to put that garlic in. That's the way. Doesn't that smell wonderful? Hey. Do you like the smell of garlic? Mm. Yes, it's yum, isn't it? Mm. And then we've got some beautiful olive oil here. And look at the colour of it. Hey, this is all cold pressed olive oil. It's come from a, an olive tree, hasn't it? No, a sunflower tree. Oh, and it's like a sunflower. Yes, we have oil with sunflower too, don't we? Yes, yeah, so this one's come from an olive tree. And we're going to have lots of sesame here. So sesame. Mm. So the sesame seeds are beautiful, aren't they? They're going to add. And we're making this recipe without any nuts in it because sometimes when we're eating lots of raw food, we have lots of nuts, don't we? So we thought today we might make it without all the nuts. And then we've got some salt. That's the way. You're going to pop the salt in for me? Yes, I think we put it all in. That's the way. Quite a lot, isn't it? And that's um, Himalayan salt, so it has lots of lovely minerals and things. And we've got beautiful protein with all our lovely dark green leafy vegetables. Yes, now you can put the, you want to press the button? You can press that one there maybe. And away. So what do you think? We'll have a smell and see. What do you, you tell me what you think. Nice. It smells beautiful, doesn't it? All from God's pantry, huh? I think God made all those beautiful things. And look, aren't we lucky? So what we're going to do is we're going to take, take these, this little tray away and we're going to put it on our noodles. So we've got those beautiful noodles. And you can decide when we put this out which one you'd like to use. You might like to have the herb one or you might rather have the basil one. Um, Which one do you think you'd like to make, to eat? The one that you've just made? Or do you think you might like to make a basil one? Because we've got a basil one. pesto there. Like that one. You'd like this one, would you? All right, so you get your little bowl of noodles over there. And you might like to put some, you might like to put some, some on. So wait, we get a spoon and you can get some out of there. Oh, there we are, you can put some on. And a little fork, that's the way. Oh, I think that's a lot, don't you? You think that's a lot? This, that looks pretty good. Now have a little smell and see what you think. Nice. Is it nice? Mm. Yes. Yeah, so we've got a nice balance in there, haven't we? Because we've got some, we've got some beautiful greens, and we can use your little fork to spread it through your noodles. And then you've got something yummy to try, haven't you? Would you like to have a little taste and see what you think? Yummy. Is it yummy? Is it? <laughs> okay, is that pretty good, isn't it? it? Smells good. And you have a look. This is another little one we made. We made the other day, and this is pest. This is one you made when you were down last time, I think. And this one's called basil, isn't it? And you tell me if you can smell the difference between the two. Does that have a different smell? Yes. What do you think? Mm. Yeah, it has a different taste, a slightly different taste, but they can both go in the noodles, aren't they? And they're just delicious. All right. Thank you everybody, we've had a lot of fun making this this morning. So here we are, we have our pesto noodle recipe.